as an institution for us to function at our top, it only comes through diversity of our workforce, it comes through diversity of our students, it comes from diversity of how we um, provide what we do for the diverse patients that we are responsible for. So if we don't have a diverse and inclusive environment, we're going to be less always than our best. What's important now, what's very different from where we were five years ago, is not only do we listen, we then take action on the things that people tell us need to change in the organization. We've achieved some very significant uh, directives. We've diversified our C-suite, so we have uh, more leaders of color and more women at the table in our C-suite than we've ever had at any point in history at MUSC Health. The team is different. The team is happier, more content, and that's a great thing uh, to see as well. Everything that we do that not just makes people feel welcome, but that really celebrates the differences between us and how that adds to who we are as an institution is, I think, critical to our future. We're a medical university, so when people come to the medical university from the community, they should see the community. We have students and visitors from all over the world, I and mean, we're on a truly on a global stage. When you take care of patients, it's best done with a more diverse team, and that team has the best ideas, is able to give the best care. My best ideas have never come from me sitting in my room by myself dreaming up things. It comes from conversation, it comes from different viewpoints, it comes from different ideas. Respect should be the first level of relationship. When you respect uh, uh, the, the other, you see the humanity in the other, and you uphold that person and treat that person with dignity. I do think that we have seen change the last few years. I'm starting to see more and more uh, opportunities for individuals to go into a meeting and see different cultures all represented within the room. Even again, the openness to talk about disability in terms of diversity is different. Speaking from the LGBTQ perspective, we have residents and students who have come here who have identified as LGBT. We're taking actions to make sure that this is not just a check in the box. We take these values into heart. And you got to talk about it and then you got to make sure everybody's talking about it down through the organization. Some people think that when you achieve a goal or you achieve a metric around diversity and inclusion that you've won. Well, it's never over. This work is never over. But we strive continuously to make sure that we're being the best organization that we can be in the moment at the time for our employees and our patients and their families. This is who we are. We're about respect. We're about inclusion. There's no questions, there's not hesitation. It provides a, a solid foundation for us to continue to move forward.